right, you getting started. The... Winners finals. WebJP versus EQ. Yeah. Three, two, one, go. So this is definitely gonna be very weird because it's gonna be a lot harder for Lucas maybe to get in because of um blaster, so I mean, I yeah, but like that. if he commits to the blaster, then he can just absorb it. So like that's a kind of like that's a double-edged sword. You know, he's kind of got the handle. I mean, still, it, it could be tough. Like I said, I, I think all the mother kids are weird. How do you? How do You're you goofy fight? boy. Yeah. You don't. <laughs> um. Well, very even off so far. But very also, um, very kind of, I guess it's like the methodical kind of play soccer. They're not really trying to do the most, to really get a first hit. Does anybody know if EQ has a Twitter? I keep not tagging him. Mm -mm. He doesn't, I don't think he has a Twitter, because I haven't seen it. Yeah. I mean, if it's somewhere, it's not on his Smash GG, so I can't, I can't pull it. Anyway. Mm -hmm. All right, so Very you know, nice pick, yeah, WebGP gonna take first stock. Um, woo! But EQ going hella deep and just being like, oh yeah, you know what? Very you gonna nice take my stock? I, I think it's time I take yours. Hmm. So Sonic is enhancing that. Time to take <laughs> my bread back. Um. Yeah. So you know, uh, WebGP kind of having stage control still though, and keeping him off stage. Uh, this is a scary situation. Oh, oh, very nice. Oh. Able to parry that landing hitbox of the fair. And, you know, EQ just has spent this entire stock just trying to recover to the stage. Even now, I would say, well, before that grab, even then he was just being pressured. Uh, but finally able to uh, relinquish that pressure and uh, apply some of his own. Okay. And back into offstage. Nope, but uh, recovers early. Uh... WebJP kind of holding center, but then relinquishes it just a little bit. Nope. Pulled back as a bait, pulling up, pushing him back off. Okay. Very EQ. nice, like, uh, no, kind of a uh, This is all very not great. EQ had, like, relinquished center, but then WebJP just, like, air dodged off stage, but then EQ failed to, uh, like, edge guard. Like, get, guys. It's winner's finals. Get What's your shit together. <laughs> how, how, what happened? What just, why, why is the... Baby, what is you doing? Weird. Okay, well... What, what's, what's, are you spooked? Yeah. Alright, well, WebJP going to take the second stock. Uh, kind of like a repeat of, like, the first stock. If uh, EQ is able to just, like, uh, take it right back. Which... Oh! Ooh, close! But no cigar. Oh, very. Oh, oh, very <laughs> nice. Very nice. Um, easy color. Okay. Very nice kind of like maneuverability around these two because they're definitely like also doing something but not really like doing the most. Trying to overextend. Yeah. Kind of like hiding. You know, around each other, not like exactly that. Very yeah, nice. But wow, that, that. But I, by default, that helps with JP because he's the one with the stock lead. So, game one, going to WebJP. Let's see that again. Nice, you know. very nice. Yeah, it's a tough situation when you're a stock behind. Uh, like when your when your opponent just gets like full control. Uh, it's just like, oh, well, you don't want to commit because you don't want to get punished and make your deficit even greater. But it's like, I don't have to commit, so I'm going to just, like, wait uh, for you to, like, you know, die. I think, I mean, some people kind of underestimate the power of being aggressive. Because, granted, you know, there's only certain situations where you, like, really need to be, like, actually patient even when you're not in the lead. Like, I would definitely say... Like, Zelda's one of those situations because granted, like, oh, yeah, not it, really it, mentioning online, definitely, but, like, it's, it's still just very you, scary, you so. need reads on your side, like, you can't, you can't do a reactionary mm -hmm. aggression because I mean, that's an oxymoron, like, 
if you're gonna wait to see what they're doing, you have to be inherently defensive. So when you're in that lead, when you're in that like winning position, like you got to make that read, you got to make the play, obviously, because like if if they're playing it safe and you're playing it safe, like I mean, one has one stands more to gain than the other. So like you're totally right. Like you got to just like got to go for it. It's just it's hard to like figure out what you want to do, I guess, because you're just like, damn, my man's really just uh, covering every option here right now. It's like, I'm trying to get the kill, not get damage, but, like, honestly, that's usually the door. Like, if you can just get that little bit of damage, that, that can shake them. But anyway, EQ starting off pretty strong in this game, too. Uh, I definitely... Hey, uh, like, oh, wow. Oh, I, did, oh. I, did, I, did I give EQ a compliment? Did I, I meant WebJP fooling him into a false mm. sense of security so mm. that he could spike him. You're truly mm. next level 4D chess by WebJP. Wait. <laughs> You're on to something. Yeah, yeah. right? <laughs> Ooh. I definitely love this um let's check me coming in from like Love JP. He's definitely kind of like taking his like first stock and he's just running away. He's already What well, I don't even know what that was that. Two stock and a hundred thirty six percent. Oh man. That was just wow. Yeah, I, I think uh you know, both EQ and maybe Falco are just like at limitation on how they're able to like just approach Lucas like it could just be one of those things that like matchup wise or or like or player wise where it just he just can't find the in you know he doesn't know what to cover or or what to account for and I mean like you know it's I it could be it could be other that or just the fact of just like straight up matchup inexperience and and you know like That's good. yeah. Because, like, when you're it's playing, exactly like, the more mobile about. character, like, matchup and experience is better mm -hmm. for them. I don't know. It's like, Falco's going to get his stuff, but it doesn't, like, net a kill. Oh, God. All right. Very nice. Very nice to talk. Yeah. I mean, the thing with being aggressive, though, too, is that, like, you're not always going to be, you know, like, you're not always going to have that, like, 100% guarantee. Yeah. But the thing about Mixed is that, like, when it comes to, like, I'm, I'm getting in and being aggressive is that you have to kind of apply a lot of mix-ups so whenever you're approaching with something you're not always doing the same thing you have to make sure that like you're kind of playing around people to um shield so imagine like um street fighter or like any other like you know regular tv fighting game you kind of have to just kind of like play in each other's range in order to be kind of aggressive and just making sure that you know like you do things that are inherently safe and then kind of mixing up with things that inherently aren't safe so you can kind of just start like playing mind games with your opponent. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah, <laughs> staying in like within each other's burst range uh is, you know, that that is the scary thing where you're like you can be in their in their face and try and force them to do an option. But uh WebJP gonna, you know, kinda sleep on my man's a little bit here. Uh opt in to go Lucina. Uh, I've never seen him play this character. Does he He's play actually Lucina? Going Lucina a lot recently? Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, well, he's just like, on his test her out. Me. All right, well, I mean, she's definitely a, a good character. Mm hmm I mean, not not cool like Marth, but she, she's, she's all right. I mean, she she, she good AF, but uh, yeah, like, <laughs> it, it, like, if anything, like, you know, that, the double-edged sort of, like, picking, you know, top tiers is... Uh, you're gonna have more experience versus them because they're usually more popular. Uh, so, you know, and like, unless like we think WebJP's Lucina is better than uh, Monkey BenQ, who's his, you know, Lucina's his main. Um, like, you know, EQ is kind of already doing like way better. Uh, this might not be working out, but you know, WebJP does have a few games to play with. So if he wants to take this as a learning opportunity, he absolutely can do it. You know, having all of that, um, having very good, you know, fundamentals definitely allows you to kind of just like see, you know, what you're doing wrong and then what you need to improve on, like with other characters. So I definitely do see them kind of like learning from all of like these maybe one or two losses that he might want to take before he goes back to Lucas. Yeah, I could see, I could see WebJP like, uh, even if he loses this game, like just sticking Lucina being like, oh, okay. 
Because, like, he, he might just be, like, really confident in just, like, how hard he kind of just, like, beat on EQ with uh, Lucas. So it's just like, it's like, I think I can do it. But uh, right now he's getting three stocks, so. Mm, mm, the jury's still out on that one. Uh, kind of just like took a little bit of a, a nap. Hasn't whipped it up yet. Anyways, but very, I mean. I mean, if anything, this kind of gives a little bit of more insight that like. Because like normally, like if you're just purely out, out maneuvering your opponent in like terms of neutral, like where you're getting the hits in. Uh, then that can transfer over to like a lot of characters, but the fact that EQ is actually being pretty competitive does kind of tell me that there is a level of discomfort fighting Lucas, oh, wow. like specifically, like like obviously WebJP is like his his game plan and gameplay is going to be stronger with his main, but like uh, the the Smash fundamentals that go over, like when he's when he's playing Lucina, EQ at least knows has better uh, better idea of like how to approach and how to go in. And so it just shows, mm -hmm. like, matchup familiarity, like, still is playing a role here. So... I also feel like, you know, WebJP's, his Lucina, like, I said it's fairly, like, it's new. He's used it definitely before, in mm -hmm. fact, a few times. And he has his ESS as well. I feel oh, like yeah. it maybe needs, like, to just more than just, you know, fundamentals to kind of, like, play these characters. Like, I know his ESS is, like, really are good from i mean i have only seen like two or three games but they're still, it's still really good just needs a lot more of that like you know yeah character knowledge all right so i think Is he gonna stick? Nope. well unless eq leaves the the arena we're going to the same stage but wjp probably might be switching back to uh lucas oh nope it's trying zss now yeah mm -hmm. yeah you called it mm -hmm. I mean, this will probably work a lot better, um, this arm for this matchup. And I feel, I think he's played Juice before. I'm not entirely sure. I think either Juice or Kobe that on Mojo he has played. But either way, he probably might do a lot better in this matchup. Okay, very nice start. Very nice on that, um, platform pressure. Okay. Okay. Not too much of a start. Um, definitely. Try, still kind of like not knowing his way around this kind of matchup, which is very understandable because um, Falco was definitely a very weird matchup to kind of learn. Is it backing up? Nope, not yet. But very nice upbeat. Okay, they're kind of getting back to like, you know, very even percentage just now. Um, mm -hmm. All really, WebJP really needs is probably a, another up B or even a grab and just like kind of putting him into a um, off stage position again for LUT trapping. Yeah, you can definitely tell that like um, uh, maybe WebJP has been playing DSS longer than Lucina, but like he's, he's more comfortable being like slippery with this character. Like trying to get mm -hmm. the. Trying, uh, doing a good job of like avoiding the setups for the kills, Ooh. but then doing a really uh, uh -huh. whack Wait. grab right there. Okay, gonna just keep him off stage. Okay, I don't know who that one was hitting. Okay, wow. Ah. Held down, so okay. that actually a little bit of less knockback there. Uh, up throw. Very nice. That was that. I'm pretty sure. Oh no, no, wow. that is is that his forward throw? I don't know. No, 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 I don't know. I think that's up throw. Up throw. Right. Moves weird mm -hmm. looking. Oh. Oh, All right. funny. Anyway, mm -hmm. like you know, super high percent. So like EQ can definitely just like even this out. Up. Uh, Falling out of the okay. forward air, that definitely would have been the stock. But it, it like hit it in an awkward way, so it wasn't going to complete. Oh boy. Okay, I nice there. No. 
I love how. Oh, um. Oh, wow, I don't have to do 61%, but that second stock was also. Very that's. That's not too tragic. Good. Like, maybe EQ can do it, but, you know. Like, WebJP is on set point here. Uh, wins this, he'll make it into Winterside Grands. Oh. I need a But, like, if EQ can do this, he can bring it to a game five, but this is this is a tall order. Because you can definitely tell, like, it's much more even uh, compared to when he was Lucina. And, like, when it's even and you just, like, forfeit a stock like that, uh oh. You're gonna have to play even and beyond. Right now, WebJP's getting all those hits, all that hmm, extra credit. Okay. It's not gonna kill just yet. Definitely kind of getting around here. He's definitely doing a really, um, really good job at kind of just like taking this um, match kind of slow with um against the DSS. So I really like this type of approach. Just because he doesn't want to like, you know, commit overcommit too much to just, you know, very yeah. bad option. It's just gonna Nope, not yet. Ooh. It would have been a careful lock there. He could have actually punished that down air. Yeah, I think he was apprehensive of like doing up smash because probably was too far. I don't know like how far in front uh, Falco up smash hits, but doesn't matter. Uh, okay, so last stock each, hundred damage. Like you can do it if you live this. No, but you didn't. Mm, no, you did. You didn't. So oh, bad. So that's gonna be three one. Yeah. You know, it's looking a little bumpy. You know, just a little bit tiny. Just a little a smidgen. That could be worked on. Yeah. Just so. Like, yeah. Uh. So EQ gonna be making it to uh. Losers finals. He's gonna play the winner of Z minus and Nick C. Nick C, who lost to EQ. Uh, winner's round huh? three oh, yeah. or something like that. So we're going to see if that's... Minus you, yeah, so if, there, if there's the comeback for that. Uh, if Nixie does uh, make it over Z-, minus, he's going to have to try and get revenge on EQ in a best of five setting at the very least. Okay, okay, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. So do you... Okay, the Pokemon song that I was talking about, the actual name... Is Fairy Terminal. I actually had a mod pack in Smash 